darkest dungeon. <sighs> what episode is this? We don't. We still don't know. No. Because it's been no. multi. Yeah, we in keep some cases. recording multiple in the same video. So. All right. Well, welcome back to, <laughs> to Void Stairs Back episode. I'm gonna edit that in post, and if I don't, it'll look as ridiculous as it felt to do. <laughs> um, I'm, I'm John. Yeah, he's yeah. yeah. I'm I'm Joey. He's Joey, <laughs> and Josh, and I'm just here for the ride. <laughs> <laughs> I'm Joey, and uh, he's Josh. If you were confused about that obnoxious intro, um, and we're back at Darkest Dungeon. Yeah, I just gestured to a screen you can't see, um, but it's over there. Here it is, right <laughs> on display. Sweet. Send me out again. Luckily, the camera's <laughs> on the. The recording's facing the right way so that our gestures aren't completely yeah. ludicrous. Right. Um, I've forgotten everything that we went through last time. And it actually hasn't been that long since we last recorded. No. Well, uh, it's been like a month, honestly. Yeah, I guess so. Three weeks. <laughs> yeah. It, I forgot we skipped the, skipped the week, basically. Yeah. But even still, like, I usually don't... Yeah. I'm not usually this blank, but right now I'm blank, so... We, uh... Well, we, we defeated the Necromancer's Apprentice. Oh, was that our last episode? And then... I guess it must have been. I don't think that I did another one after that. I think I did... That was the last one you did. I think I did one, and then we did that, and that was the last. Well, we we end it with cleanup, right? Yes, we always... Yeah, I always recruit new folks. Yeah. And, like, set up for the next... Or, you know, as best I can for the next... Uh, How do we do this show? Yeah, I don't Leave know. Leave it in the comments below. <laughs> we... Yeah. What's What should we do next? <laughs> well, you see... Oh, if only I read the comment at the time. So yeah, we're just ready to jump back in. We got people in places, I'm sure. Yep. Relieving stress of some kind. Um, I think. I know we have at least at least Cuthbert. Montifiquet is yeah. also in there. Cloistering themselves away for this particular mission. Or week, I guess. Yeah. It's like insane that we leave for like a week. Yeah. Every time we go out to do a thing. Yeah, Cuthbert's in in the bar, drinking. Sweet. Which I think remember he can own he can't go to the gambling hall at brothel because he's. Dude, there's a thing. He's either he, he can he, only drink or he can't. He's not trusted in those places. Yeah, he's. He's, got he's some a cheat. Bad, he's got some bad tendencies. All right. Uh, well, cool. I mean. Yeah, I don't think there's anything here. Yeah, we did nope. the stagecoach at the end, so right. we're ready to jump into the next. Uh, uh, Dungeon. I mean, the only other thing that you could do, and I don't know, I think you did a tiny bit of this, would be like any upgrades that you want to make to your people, like get the blacksmith and and that sort of a thing. Do you know what I mean? Right. We did a little bit of it, but I think we did it before embarking last week. Yes. And you didn't want to like go through everybody. Yeah. Which is reasonable because you don't want to lose all your money, but yeah. Also, I don't know if you felt any any need to want to, you know, improve people or unlock other abilities to change, like, their loadouts and that sort of thing. Yeah. I mean, I think if you'd want to do that, you should pick your mission first. You know what you're kind of getting into. Right. And can map it out. All right, so there's no story-driven stuff? Nope. I forget what the orange means. I think that's... Length of mission, perhaps? Nope. Oh, it's level. Yeah, so you still got some level one missions, but it's starting to populate with some big boy stuff. Right. And you don't have a fully kitted squad of big boys. No. Um, I don't even have... Gerard is about to be level three. Right, I think that's where we're at. <laughs> Cuthbert might have been close too, but he's got a. Oh, did they? Did, did they? I thought he's still on the list somewhere, but he just has like a different symbol around him. Yeah, Montepicat is still there. Cuthbert, Cuthbert, there he he's is. Got yeah. The, yeah, he's got the bar. So he's about two. Yeah. So he's he's a full level behind uh, Gerard, but he's been Gerard's been like basically yeah. going to every single mission. Yeah. Because he's a beast. Yeah. And like, you've been able to heal his. Um, Mm -hmm. Sanity. This team was awesome. I really like this crew. Yeah, I don't know how you made it out the way you did. 
Like, not that you should have died, but like, shouldn't have been so easy. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. Excuse me. Oh, Ugh. goodbye. I'm gonna grab myself my snacks and my drink. I forgot them on the table. We'll move this. Ugh. Thank you very much, there we go. I like how you're better at remembering to use coasters in my house than I am. Well, it's not my house. <laughs> That's true. I don't use co coasters in my house. I only started employing coasters. As, I don't know why I'm looking there. Here's the camera. <laughs> I only started employing coasters. <laughs> Just pointing off camera because, at something. Because uh, we started playing board games so regularly. I didn't want there you know, to be wet rings right, yeah. for pieces to sit on. I don't, really, I don't really care about the integrity of the table right? as so much as I do about putting cardboard in water <laughs> or whatever have you. Um, That's character. <laughs> I beg you, no. <laughs> no, not me. He's our strongest man. He wouldn't last a minute. I fear this task is beyond me. I yearn for adventure. Are you it's, sure, buddy? Yeah. <laughs> okay. Um, Let's look at the rewards. There was a button that we could press to let's <laughs> look at that, that we have to learn every single episode. Oh, look, you got it. Crusader only. 10% melee. Healing skills. That feels pretty good. Yeah. An oil painting of some distant family relation. So right now you're low on deeds. We are. Very. And each of these zones is generally um, better for finding different things within the locations. Like, mm. the ruins are better for deeds, probably. Um, or perhaps yeah. portraits. Mm -hmm. And then, you know, likewise for all the other ones, I, I think. I could be wrong about that, but I feel like I heard that at some point. There's a grail. A, a what? A grail. That's kind of weird. Mm-hmm. Just increases their health. Who's the Vestal? My. Uh, That's the healer at the end yeah, of your squad list yeah. there. Ah! Oh, there's two goblets. There's a golden one somewhere. Aha! Some virtue chance. I feel like you already have one of those. Uh, I feel like I do too. Or at least you have that effect anyways. Right. Oh, that's the thing we already looked at. Have you met a high woman? Yeah, isn't that Cuthbert? Oh yeah, I guess he is. You start yeah. with one. Yeah. <laughs> oh. This is a dark team. Yeah. 10% oh. stress. Jeez. You should do something of an easier mission of some kind. Okay. Because we recently got a new person. Right. Um, the antiquarian. Right? Yeah. Right there. I don't remember. Is it square? Yeah. Basically, with the antiquarian on your squad, you'll pick up antiquities. Right which are worth money, and it's basically kind of your main purpose for some kind of a mission is to just kind of bring them along. Hopefully they, they do, you know, good stuff, as well as provide this sort of uh, extra thing that you can be going for during the sure, mission. Sure, right. But uh, it's, a, it's, it's the way that you farm for cash, and cash becomes important very quickly. Well, I don't know about quickly, but as the game goes on, yeah, the less cash you have, the more you'll notice. Or the more you'll be like at zero, you know, after having to buy the things you need. Because I think you want to be in a place where you're actively upgrading your dudes as often as you can manage. Right. Because, like I've warned before, this game can get up, like, it can get ahead of you, you know, get away from you. I think that's the phrase. All right. Uh,. But that's just a recommendation. You could upgrade him to give him different yeah. effects too, if you're, you know, onto nervous stab. His protect one's really good. The little, I think it's the shield one. It like gives somebody else, it like forces them to protect him. 
minus 100%. Jeez. It doesn't do damage, basically. Right. First guard. Okay. So she's like super support, basically. Uh, yeah, in this current iteration thing. That one doesn't seem like the worst. Yeah. Wait, which one are you highlighting right now? Oh yeah, that one. What's the green one? I'm sorry, the locked green one. Oh, it, it's a heal other. Yeah. Got it. That doesn't, that doesn't seem very good. No. Interesting. Are all the other vapors, are they other? Or are they self? Vapors. Oh, that's a, an attack. Yeah. Okay. And then the blue one at the top. At the uh, edge of the list, sorry. Target. Yeah. Cool. Dodge is really good. Yeah. I don't know. I, th I think she's pretty good right now. Yeah. Okay. Um, but yeah, I, I, you know, you, you want to also maybe try and get some of your level zeros out. Yes, I do. Get some experience under their belts as well. Winston. He's cool. He wants to be in the front. Oh, it moves him forward. Interesting. Oh, and it does knockback and nice. stun. That's sweet. So it displaces the other team a little bit. Yeah. Oh, it's all of them? Jeez. And it doesn't do damage, but it makes them easy to hit. Yeah. And it gives them a bonus to crit received when if they're marked. Hmm. Oh, repost. Dang, that's so good. Wow. Retribution. What does it do? Normally it does... 85. Oh, it's kind of a weaker attack, but yeah, it does a little bit. Retribution seems great. Okay. What's the shield? The locked one? Guard ally. Yeah. And buff yourself. That'd be really good to get. I don't know what you'd trade it for, but... Maybe the bellow? Yeah. I mean, bellow can be really good, though. Especially if you're up against a lot of fast things. Just dodging all your shit. Or not fast things, and you just want to make sure your guys land. Yeah. Because they still sometimes miss. Right. The minus five speed, I think, is the big one there, too, is because mm -hmm. you'll basically go first until that wears off. Yeah. Okay, so we can put him him and the antiquarian together. Let's see what else we got. I feel like you should put those two as well. Yeah. Because... Dwund can be the healer, although risque, you can maybe preemptively purchase bandages for the potential bleed that he'll cause with this heal effect. He's very big, you yeah. know, single target healer. Uh, and then the bowman can sit all the way in the back and just fire her crossbow. And then you'll have maybe a tiny bit of synergy with the marking stuff. Right. Just kind of happenstance. But then, yeah, but you'll have, like, her the last place, then the Antiquarian third. Where does she want to be? Yeah, third. Yeah. And then you'll have um, Dwund. Yeah. Second. Yep. And then and Winston first. Okay. Then they'll be able to use all their stuff. Right. Doesn't seem too bad. Nope. It's okay. just a matter of what mission you want to send them on, I think. Uh, well, let's see. 
Also, have you unequipped all of your trinkets and stuff? No. They're still on people. From your old dudes? No, they'd still be on everybody. So you should quit these bad boys before you send them out. Yeah. Quit uh, these bad boys. I'm trying to remember if but any of them have places they want. Yeah, see, she wants to be in the cove. Okay. Uh... Likes it in the light. Yeah. Armor taker. Oh, that's hot. Oh. Doesn't like the wield. Okay. So right now we got Cove, a vote for Cove. Yeah. And a vote against wield. And okay. then what about Winston? He had no preference. Gotcha. Just extra healing while camping. Death blow resist. He's slightly less HP. That's not great for your tank. <laughs> no. He still has 28, though. We'll get that sorted later. Yeah. Maybe after this mission. Okay. Uh, so basically, this mission will test your sanity since you have no one to heal sanity right now. Mm hmm. Because you're not taking the Jester. Um, so. That'll right, be what you want to keep track of. back. Maybe. Um. Hold square to unequip. There you go. Look at all this stuff. So much maintenance in between. Yeah, there's a bit. Uh, that eye patch was Winston's only. Yeah. Could only be on Winston, so that'll probably make it right back to him. But yeah, how do I. You were doing it a second ago. You just select them and you bring. Ooh. Yeah, that button. There you go. Cool. Um, all right. Do you have anything else that's only somebody? I'm trying to remember how I. <laughs> there we go. Abomination only. I can't wait. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I think you're gonna just try and force him. It's gonna be great. <laughs> Uh, ooh, bleed resist. Oh, that's kind of scary, though. So, the reason you might want bleed resist is since you have... Uh, yeah, dwund healing. Dwund yeah. potentially bleeding people out. Yeah. But, maybe the cove is disease-ridden. You know? Yeah. I don't know. I... No, I, I just don't, I actively don't know if it's, like, more <laughs> disease-ridden than any other place. Right. Or if that's like the wield, or or if yeah. that's actually an equal spread. Well, I could put this on him to negate the f the fragile. If I yeah, who to. cares if he's slow? Yeah, he's the big tank. Um. Oh, that's that's hot. Yeah, we had that on uh, the the Hellion or whatever. Hmm. She oh, did we? I think that, so. She was dodging like an insane person. Yeah. So, I've, I've forgotten. I, I remember that that whole sequence of her yeah. not getting touched, but I didn't remember. Scouting chance traps. Okay. Yeah, we definitely. I think I think you're right about the the die. Yeah. Or stone, health stone. Okay. There. He's at his normal match HP. Max Yay. HP. All right. Um. Do her. So, figure out who's your spongiest. So, 17 HP for her. 27, 19. So, she is. I think she should get the cloak, the dodgy cloak, and the, the health buff cloak. Sure. Because then. Because, like. One heal from Dwund basically heals her to full. So if yeah. she takes a reduction to what, how much healing she can receive. Right. It isn't, you know, maybe it isn't as horrible. I'm going to say that, and then we're going to get a bunch of zero heals. Right. <laughs> and you're going to be in a bad place. So wait, we want this one too? Just make her super dodgy. Oh. Is that what we're trying to... Yeah, who cares if she goes last? She's just the, the 
uh, yeah. Support. Touch is 22. <laughs> I hope she, I hope she never gets hit. <laughs> How incredible. Um, all right. I hope she dodges mental trauma. Yeah. That's how good at dodging she is. I think that should go on somebody. Probably her. Yeah. She probably has the highest trap disarm. Yeah. Um, in your particular crew? It could actually be the antiquarian, but I think it's probably the arbalist. I mean, you also don't want to get your whole party too slow as well. Right. So maybe it's not worth scouting. Scouting's pretty good, though. This just seems like a no-brainer. Just put it on somebody. Yeah. Maybe Dwund. I don't know. I don't want the virtue... Uh... You don't want the healer to go, like, crazy on you. Yeah, right. Stop doing what he wants, you know, what he's supposed to do. Yeah. Oh, yeah, did we want to put bleed resist on somebody? Yeah, I don't know. It's a tough call because of the disease. Yeah. But it could be worth it. Maybe Blight's pretty common in Cove. Yeah, I have no idea. I'm just sort of judging it thematically on, like, right. the implication of it being Cove. So that should go on somebody just because. Yeah. I guess the one reason you might not want to equip something that's just blatantly good um, with no downsides is because if your guy dies, it's gone. Oh. You don't loot sure. your dead friends. Yeah. Those, those items are yeah. you know, basically being put up at risk. Yeah, that's fair. Lost. Well, I mean, everybody's full at this point, so <laughs> let's go. Yeah, I mean, you're all kitted out. Let's just go get some more cool stuff. All right. Um, here we go. Um, so there are a couple mediums, but if you're... So you don't want to go to the Weald. No, we want to go to Cove. Cove is incentivized by one of your dudes, and then the rest are... They break even. No one's... But you've got to sort your dudes out first. Yeah. How Which do I... I don't remember. I don't either. Like that. We want him here. No! Blast. All right. Provision it up. And you're getting something for... What's that? What's What was the powder for? The, the trinket? The hide That's yeah. right. Yep. That's pretty cool. All right, man. So you start with some bleed resistance due to the arbalist, some some bandages, I mean. Yep. The the key is probably due to the antiquarium. Oh, probably. Um, and then the other two don't provide you with anything, I guess. Yeah. So you definitely want some food. This is a short mission as well, so. Food stacks in twelve, I believe. Oh right. Yeah. I've already got a stack of bandages, so you're not going to eat up space by having more, and you might cause your own self-bleed. So I, I think a few bandages of some quantity, I, uh, I think would be a good idea. Holy Keys water. might not be the worst either. Sure. Since you're antiquarying it up. Need some torches. Yeah, that's... We didn't really use many last time, and I went on a longer one. <laughs> so. Right. It's the horrors of the dark. And we found out that laudanum isn't something that you ingest. Right? Like, you couldn't use yeah. it on yourself. Right. So it's something that you need for, you know, some kind of interaction, or, or, or maybe yeah. if you're afflicted with something, maybe. I don't know. It's like a triggered thing more than a... Scouting's 40%. Nice. Um, what? 
up there tells you what your scouting's at. Oh. Okay. You ready? Yeah. Here we go. Into the cove. This is exciting. Getting to see more more of the uh, areas. Yeah. You've only been in the ruins I know. for the past like eight weeks or whatever. Yeah. We're only at week six, I think. That's a lot. You went into the ruins six times. Yeah. I explored each one once before I even like decided did anything. Yeah. Yeah, I was like, what? And they whooped my ass, I think. I don't remember <laughs> it going great. These salt soaked caverns are teeming with pelagic nightmares. They must be flushed out. So this is a 100% of room battles. Um, so you don't have to go down because you know that it's an empty room. Oh, sure. But you can if you wish to interact with the curios and the book thing and have a battle. Well, I could go to just get the curios and the book. I yeah, mean, just I back have... out. Yep, that's true. You could do that. So I want to go down. Yep. Oh, here's your first one. Eerie coral. I'm just gonna investigate it. Ooh. Oh, nice. And a box. Oh, this is a shovel thing. Don't interact with it. That's like a like debris that yeah. you have to clear yeah. to, to progress. It's <laughs> they don't like walking backwards, people. Oh really? Yeah. It's not like crazy horrible, but like yeah. That's funny. <laughs> backtracking is something they don't like to. And remember that that's a trap. You'll see it on the ground. Keep right. an eye out for it. Right. Gesture with the right stick. Uh, I think your arbalist is the best disarm. Oh right. She's How got the I... thing equipped. There you go. There it is. See it? Yes. It, it'll outline itself when you can interact. Just sneak up to it. Oh, okay. You press the same button that you interact with any curio. Ah, I didn't get it. Watch your step. Ooh, 19, that's a big hit to sanity there. Oh, she's got a, she's also got some. Some kind of debuff on her. Yeah. What is it? I forget how to look. Dodge, oh Jesus, 11 rounds. Oh, wow. Oh no. <sighs> That's, <laughs> oh look at that background. Big old whale. It was like, like that tells some kind of insane story. Yeah. They fought back this whale and then something came out of it. Fish, folks. <gasps> See what, slash. Yeah, you guys are pretty slow right now. Oh, man. Okay. All right, your healer should probably do some healing. Uh, yep. On mm -hmm. himself. I think uh, since your Arbalist can cause someone else to protect him or her. Yeah. That your uh, your frontman should probably protect the healer. Right. Oh, you don't have the protect with him, do you? Oh, well, we're about to find out. I don't think you do. You can mark... Oh, I think you do the retribution. Yeah, mark myself. Yeah, well, no, you'll mark the target. Oh, right, right, right. But having a repost is good, because if your antiquarian can trigger, cause... Yeah. It's like a good synergy if, if you're protecting the antiquarian, but also can repost. Yeah, this is what we want right here, dodging the antiquarian. So yeah, use the shield thing. It'll, it'll make front man there guard you. Right. So if any attack would target him, or it'll instead target the front man. Yeah. And he's got repost. So right. you get like all these double trigger situations going. Yeah. And he's marked now. He so. marked himself. Oh, he did? Yeah, the repost marks him. Okay, cool. Yeah. All right. So some of these are, like blind fire can um, 
you don't get to pick who you attack, I don't think. I think right. you just click and it, oh yeah, right. random target. Yeah, um, but. But it does a little bit more damage than suppressive fire, I think it's called, number two. Suppressing fire. Yeah. It doesn't, that doesn't do a lot of damage, but you can target two people in the back. Right. And then the first one does, I think, the most damage. Yeah. It, but it's better against marked dudes. Which this I can mark somebody in. Right. And make him less likely to dodge. Speeding my... Speeding her up isn't the worst either. Yeah, yeah. What was that? I don't know. It was like a notification sound. Yeah. I feel like I had to come from the PlayStation, if anywhere. Oh, I, wait. I do? What? It says random target, but it's letting me pick. Oh. I don't think it matters. I think if you just pick it, still... Maybe not. Maybe it's a chance that it oh, doesn't hit your target. Yeah. Yes. It's so good. That's awesome. That's not good. <laughs> These are big hits. Yeah, they are. He's just going to be healing himself this whole freaking time. This is not great. Ooh. Nice. Uh, oh. Oh, sorry, kitty. I didn't even know you were there. <laughs> I'm moving back a little bit. Oh, you're going to be. I shall put you back in frame. All right. Antiquarian. So is he guarded still? Yeah, he's guarded still. Yeah. How long does that last? Two rounds. That's pretty good. I think you should start buffing some fools with your uh, invigorating vapors. You should... Does that do it to everybody? No, it's one target. I got excited there. No, that's everybody. It's everyone. That's so good. What? Oh, wow. Wow. Kill. <laughs> I think I want to get Do you have something that marks some people at all? I can knock back. While marked. No. You just mark yourself. Yeah. That's okay. Yeah, just go for damage. So yeah, this is a tricky thing. So your Arbalist still has yet to act. Yeah. You definitely need somebody to take out the front man. Because having fewer people to attack you is better than dealing damage around. Right. So, it's whether or not you want the... I'm gonna have the Arbalest kill them. You chose very quickly, but I was... Oh. I think the only thing I can target is the random thing, the blind fire. Huh. Well... Yeah, it didn't hit him. Okay, well... So yeah, it's a chance. Yeah. You can still target somebody and it, it doesn't really matter. Dodge... Oh. Reduces accuracy? Yeah, to all of them. Is that accuracy or is that... Yeah, I guess it is, yeah. 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 Still guarded. Can you, like, can you double the benefits of invigorating vapors? And it'll let me do it again. Well, yeah, I, I'm, I just didn't know if it just resets the timer or if it gives you plus six while they overlap. Yeah, I don't. Hello. Oh. Thanks, computer, for letting me know about all that. <laughs> it's really important stuff. I, I, I would try and double it up and then check to see if it's plus six. How do I, uh, yep. Oh man. You just keep doing that. You gotta heal your man at arms. Yep. Big boy in the front. Well, you're luckily avoiding the bleed. Okay, so that front man still has yet to act. You gotta kill his right. kill his ass. Ooh, this pushes? Yeah. So you could decide where the corpse will be laid. 
if you don't mind the corpse being front and center, yeah, you can do that. Or you can leave the corpse up front and just hit him with a a mace in the face. Kind of like how much health does he have? One. Yeah. What does your third ability do? Because it hits everybody. No, no damage. Oh, no damage. What about yeah. the? Oh yeah, that's the only one that hits everybody. Okay, never mind. I was gonna say if you can get like a little bit of damage out. Right. Uh, let's just end him. Oh, oh you hate to see that, Jackie. Whew. Oh, he's out of his repost. Oh, I should have. I didn't realize that. I didn't either. It's okay. We'll get it next time. Yeah. <laughs> this blind fire thing has <laughs> not been proven great. You should, instead of blind fire and hope you kill the front man, try to kill the third man, maybe. With, like, a direct shot. Sure, yeah. He's only got four, yeah. Oh, he's a little fish head. <laughs> That's great. This has been a pretty rough fight for you. It's the first one, too. Yeah. Oh, man. She gets to go Maybe again. Maybe I was meant to just hang out in the ruins on my first playthrough. <laughs> yeah. I got I got a little bit more savaged. Shoot the second man. He did a lot of damage with that. As Damn. Falls, I feel like she used that ability more. It's really good. Yeah. Heal. Nope, that's the wrong thing. Himself? Oh my guy. Oh man. <laughs> That's a tough call. So he's only got um, nine health to heal for himself. Yeah. And there's more health to heal in the man at arms because he's got 31 total. Right. So the man at arms, respectively, has a bit more health in him that he can yeah go through. <sighs> and so if if you get if one gets attacked by two people before he can heal himself, that's he's dead. Oof! Nice. All the way to he's full. bleeding. He's yeah. bleeding now. <laughs> yeah. We got bandages. All right. You definitely need to heal frontman boy, dude. You got to use the protect thing again, maybe. Give him plus four dodge and protection. Yeah. And then the repost thing. Oh, and you could kill that guy at the same time. Repost is so overpowered. Ooh, you can get a heal in. Your hero is bleeding. Oh no. I like how it tells you after you've started to bleed, <laughs> you like yeah. lost blood from your body. And right. it's like, you could heal that, you know. So you can heal that if you want now by toggling to the, I don't know how you do it, I forget. Toggling to the inventory. Don't hold, don't hold triangle. Nope. If you're gonna use it. <laughs> <laughs> oh. All right. Uh. Are you comfortable in your current position? Comfortable enough, yeah. Why? Well, I'm gonna adjust the camera a little bit. Oh, sure. Because we, right. we were we were Definitely sitting shifted. at attention. Yeah. Uh, when we started, so. Yeah. Let's give us a bit of a rotation here. Aw, only three. What happened? Uh, did a bit of damage to it. The thing attacked him, and he. Like yeah, you, you got to heal that man at arms. Well, when one gets another turn, invigorate those sweet, sweet vapors, baby. <laughs> Attack a corpse. I don't know. Or maybe, maybe Bella. It does no damage to him. Well, you don't want him to die before you can get a heal off. Yeah, that's true. <laughs> the only one that mattered dodged. Yeah, just shoot a corpse. It didn't even take it out. Oh, no. 
Ugh. Just, can, just think of it as spreading the damage around. Oh no! Why? No, it's between zero and thirteen. Oh, that's so bad. Okay, you're already at the sixth round. You don't like it, it, they could get reinforcements. Yeah. So you don't want to mess around too much longer. But you do want to try again, I think, maybe. Yeah, Because just, so just trying to heal with food is just, uh, you're in a bad place. This is not a great start. Oh, here's your chance. Get him. Oh, there it is. Yay. There's a big boy. And dodge. <gasps> oh, God. All right, time to kill this fucker. You healed more than you lost there. <laughs> Get him. <laughs> I think he's gonna die on his own turn. How much blight does he have? How do you look at statuses again? One damage for three rounds. So if he's not at one health, then it won't he won't die. He has two now. That motherfucker. Confidence surges as the enemy crumbles. Well you got a lot of stuff from that. Oh, that the thing at the very end, that's what the antiquarian is for. Minor antiques. Ah. Worth money in bunches. So yeah, the more that you gather sure. from in, from encounters and stuff like that, um, the more money you bring in just by bringing the antiquarian along. What's the <sighs> bracer? Gotcha. Okay. Yikes. Yeah. That's a big sell. Well, you made it through the first battle. Oh my gosh. Was that a room battle? Yeah. Yeah. Or no. Are you in a hallway? I can't tell. I can't tell. I either. think you're in a hallway. Oh no. Yeah. No, it's, just no. a, it's just a battle. <laughs> These fish people fucked you up. Oh. It's dark. Yes. What I'm trying to do is figure out. It's probably why you got so much loot, because it's dark. There we go. Oh, this is a tiny place, though. Yeah, I think you should eat some food. Yeah, I think so, too. Yeah, it's in, because it's so tiny. Not all of it. Just in case you hit a... F I think they're called hunger spaces. Yeah. Randomly, it'll be like, your party's hungry. Uh, do you have the food? If not, they're sad. Munch, munch. I don't know, like, it's, what, I guess it's gotta be Gauntlet, right? Like, perpetuated the idea that food is like health. Yeah, I guess so. Yeah, I'm not, I'm not really sure where that started. That's definitely one of the early ones, though. Okay. Red Wizard needs food badly. You might want to light some torches unless you want to be in the dark. I like the dark, Joey. I mean, it gets you better loot. I'm not, still not used to these controls, man. Yeah, they don't yeah. seem intuitive. They are not. This you game, played this on PC. It's, PC. It's, it's built yeah. for PC. I was going to say, it seems this is like... The, this is the port. <laughs> it definitely seems like a PC game. It's like, so just, much nicer to be able to just yeah. drag stuff and click stuff. It's yeah. way nicer. Yeah, this is. it is not intuitive on... Maybe like some some long amount of time once you're done with this playthrough, we'll play this again for the, for the cast. <laughs> sure. Uh, with me, okay, maybe, yeah, as the frontman, and then we'll play on PC. Ooh, oh, these guys are sweet. Call of the Deep. All right, you want to get your licks in, get some stuns, maybe. Status effects, get your protection going. All that, all that fun stuff. Yeah, I feel like you're, you really got to focus fire with this squad if you're going to have a, a chance to do anything. Yeah. Because you didn't do any of that last time. Because you were doing the blind firing. Yeah. Um. I'm, I'm not sure what the interaction is with the jellyfish. 
I'm not sure either. It might be dangerous to melee attack the jellyfish. But having a debuff, yeah. an accuracy debuff, debuff is yeah. probably pretty good too. Ooh, the one guy resisted, all right. That's still okay. I think you get the heal off still, unless you got something really good you want to do. Stun? Ooh. Makes it darker in the room though. <laughs> oh no! I think if you can, what's the stun chances on front man? Cause he's, oh, he's got all corpses? That's nice. I wish I had It's good to know for the future. Yeah. Um, um, oh yeah, what, what's the stun resistance on the front guy? Cause he's gonna hit you real hard. Just look at him. Look at his jowls. How do I, where is it? Just target him with, an, with the attack. Oh, that works too. Wait, which guy? Oh, the frontman. I, um, you have to select your attack. There we go. Uh, stun resistance twenty-five. Yeah, you could you could totally stun him. You're not. Don't don't yeah, attack no, him. Yeah, no, I know. Yeah, yeah. That that might be a really good idea. But I don't know. It might want to weigh against your healing as well. <laughs> You're in such a tight spot. I know. No! I think it was worth a shot. Yeah. That's really bad. Oh, man. Nice. Oh. Okay, so he's protecting the jellyfish. Okay. That's actually great. That means your arbalist can attack the front man now. Yeah. Oh, that's so nice. Yeah, I think you focus fire the front man. Get All that right. riposte on. Yeah. Kill big boy. Oh, Jesus, he's got a lot of health. High protection. Okay. Dots? Ignore DOTs. Yeah. DOTs, what is Damage that? over time. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Ignore protection effect. Right, 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 right. Okay. Okay. That repost. It's so good. It I'm is. telling you, it's like if you can find dudes with it, that's where you want to be in the game. Oh. Okay, you, you got plenty of bandages. Right. You but can use that right now. I know. I think it's as good a time as any. Oh, yep. Um You could end some of those guys in the back. But that front man, he's about, he's probably not doing any buff stuff anymore now that he did it. So you could shoot him by targeting the jellyfish. Precision and power. Man, he's gonna be tough to take down. He's got a lot of protection. Yeah, he does. Mm -hmm. Maybe try to stun him again with that? Yeah. <laughs> Nice, okay. Oh, he's no longer protecting him, because he's... Yeah. Oh, that's a cool... I didn't know that. Yeah, now he loses his turn here. So you can kind of do whatever. You can apply some Blight if you want. Can you target him with the Blight? Because he's got high protection. Wait. That one, right? Oh, it's only one point for three rounds. It's not very strong. No, it's not. Never mind. Maybe just buff everybody. Yeah, I've lost my protection, but... Oh, you did? Yeah, my guard is down. I mean, that's pretty good. If you can funnel people into the riposte situation, I don't know, what, what do you think is better? <laughs> They're all pretty Cause fragile, that, I'm wondering if... Well, that also that also does yeah. uh, a, a dodge and protection buff to the man-at-arms as well. Yeah. But the other, so that one gives four dodge and 10 protection to one dude, but funnels attacks from two dudes into one dude. Yeah. And the other gives plus three, so a total of what? Eight or I mean twelve, 12. Uh, to the whole team. And it, and it maintains the mark on him, which is also yeah relevant. Yeah, funneling some attacks. Yeah. A brilliant confluence of skill and purpose. <laughs> oh, we get to go again. All nice. right. Ended up being the fastest boy. You get to do both things. Yes. Dodge it. Repost it. Bow! So good. Nice. 
Oh. I feel like not again. It's like who cares if she gets no. no. Oh man. I like how it's like a happy time. Yeah. We did it. <laughs> Zero. Um, that's not great. No, it does not. Who is this? What is this? Oh, man at arms. Nice. And I still got Riposta up, so I think I'm just gonna crush. So I try to smash this thing. Or just keep taking out this big guy. So it looks like the jellyfish just causes a like it's a weak attack, but it causes bleed. Yeah. So it's about kind of whether you think you can manage that better than maybe some bigger hits, because those guys that are going to act in this round in a moment, yeah, um, are probably going to be able to do bigger hits. Yeah. How much health does last guy have? Seven. I might be able to kill him. What's what's hero's damage is between five and nine. So that's a decent chance you could get it if you hit. Nice. All right. That was definitely the right choice. Ooh. Oh, yeah. Oh, the repost wore off right after I... Yeah, that's why we thought. I think, yeah. Because it... Might want to have bandaged. Oh, maybe. Let's hope we hit that heal. We're going we're gonna to do just fine. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> well, it didn't target her. That's good. But now you got two people in the red. Oh no. This is really not great. All right, you better bandage. I know you don't have any more, but she's almost dead. <laughs> Four health. Just shoot him. Shoot him? Just keep killing them with, with, with your, with your guns. Oh, this is really bad. Ooh, he is. <laughs> I think he might die on his turn. Oh man, from the bleed. Well, like have a yeah. death, death blow, which could kill him. Yeah, you want that repost back? Oh no. Oh, you well, got the repost. That's bad. Death waits. What do I? No! Oh no! <laughs> he didn't. He didn't roll. He didn't roll a saving, a saving throw. <laughs> it's our first death, Dwund. No! The only healer on the team. Oh man! You you just okay. So all you need to focus on here before I talk about anything, is getting through this fight. Yeah. Just press on through this particular skirmish. <laughs> the, the cove is no fucking joke. This guy's hit hard. All right. You definitely need a more healing-centric team, I think. Yes. Or or just a beefier team. Yeah. You had a couple weak links. Yeah, now, now you're out of place. Yep. Oh, man. The most you can do is festering. What is it? gonna blight some people for a little bit. Yeah, definitely do it on the protection guy, the, the, that one. So that'll deal a total four damage, but if you keep doing it, it'll stack. Right. Shoot him with an arrow, man. I mean, I don't know. Yeah. Load it up. Just get rid of the big boy. That's fine. It's better than him smacking you right now, yeah. I think. Yep. <laughs> How many how many rounds do you have on your repost? Because last time two, two rounds. Okay, so okay. next round you'll have to do it again if you yes. want it to be contiguous. To stay up. Yep. Yeah. Is he dead? Nope. No, he's got two health, I think. Ooh, nice. Resisted the stun. This is yeah. I'm just gonna keep. Well, he's protected, so you're attacking the jellyfish either way. Yeah. Or, no, you're attacking him yeah. either way is what I meant. So you can ignore the barnacle guy, I think. Hover over his ability, his uh, status effects. H how do you do that? Two damage per round. So he'll, he'll die he's on his own turn. He's going to die, yep. So don't even touch him. 
Oh yeah, he's protected, that's right. Yeah, I didn't have a choice. I forgot. Oh, and she can't. She can blind fire. I don't know if blind fire targets corpses. I think it can, but, well, dodged it anyways. Blind fire again. There you go. Oh, this, yeah, this thing was tiny. Uh oh. <gasps> she will bleed out, but she might not die from it. Oh my god. This this jellyfish might kill oh like my god. kill two of your dudes. This jellyfish is kicking your ass. <laughs> Stupid gel no! The true test. I fear I'm lost. Okay, so it's it's her turn. You need to bandage, right? Because it'll trigger your death roll each time that bleed tries to go off. And you might want to. I don't know if you can eat food right now. Just tap. Nope. It. No. Okay, so you really can't eat food right now. Okay, so yeah, you just have to take your turn. But the bleed won't trigger it anymore. You just have to hope you either kill the jellyfish with a blind fire and. A man at arm's turn? There you go. Okay. <gasps> oh, look! Oh, what is that? Okay, oh. so you have one of those, but... Oh, no, no! That's... that's you, you You retrieve the stuff your dude was carrying, actually. Those those first two? Oh, nice! That's... Oh, okay. Man, that must be new. Oh, it's an, it's a rare antique, antique from your, from your antiquarian. Nice. Instead of a, a, a thingy. How much is it worth? Damn. That is nice. Oh, it's, it's you guys' stuff. I should carry this home. Okay, so you scouted, so you can get an idea of what you're going into here. Oh my god. Yeah, you have to you have to walk through this whole thing to finish the quest, so... Because the, the, the mm -hmm. room battle is the last room. Yeah. So you can choose here to abandon your quest, but you take a hit on on like what you come back with. I think. Oh really? Yeah, I I don't know. I don't remember exactly what all the things that you take a hit for, but you you press the embark thing, I think, to trigger it up there. The X. You see it at the top mm, left. Yeah. Um. But that will abandon your current quest. You can you can munch on some food and try and press on without a healer, but. That's risky business, man. I can't, I'm not gonna be held responsible for that decision. <laughs> Since you're, you definitely don't have a healer. And even when he was around, he was he was critting zeros. So. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I, I, don't, I don't know the full logistics of like, what you don't get if you abandon, but. You Ooh. definitely don't get the quest rewards, obviously. Yeah. Like those three things that. Yep. Um, you might walk out with everything in your inventory. I think you might you might just have that stuff. Makes sense to me that you would. Yeah. Um, Experience-wise, I don't know what happens either. I don't know if it changes the chances of you rolling negative quirks oh, upon right. like leveling up and that sort of thing either. Who who is the who is, was he the one who liked the cove? Because that'd no, be that'd be no, poetic the justice. Him. The antiquarian was. <laughs> yeah. Right. <laughs> Let's go there. I'm uh, so good there. Ugh. Oh, murdered man. by a jellyfish, little face hugger. Sucked his brain out of his nose. Yep. No, we can't carry on in this state. You're gonna preserve your peeps. Do you like to retreat? The oh, heroes no. will suffer stre stress. the stress of defeat. So yeah, they'll probably get stressed, and you'll have to send them to their to various places. Collected heirlooms. Where did you get those? Did you pick those up? Yeah. Oh, yeah. okay. Yeah. yeah, so it didn't look like you got all of your inventory. I got a large portion of it. Yeah, yeah. It just I I didn't don't know that I saw everything, but maybe maybe it didn't doesn't show trinkets. Negative quirk. Oh, look at the one skull. You brought a skull back. 
Oh no! What? <laughs> That's what you get for blind firing the whole campaign. Uh, well, that was a short week. <laughs> Even these dirt covered dullards have their uses. Put them to work. A free upgrade. Oh, you get a you get a building upgrade. Oh, that's so hot. You could upgrade your uh, um, carriage or whatever, mm -hmm. your uh, stagecoach. Have more people in your thingy. Cuthbert had a night on the town and recovered 56 stress. Montifiquet meditated and recovered 56 stress. All right. And then you had some general stress recovery of people yep. just hanging out in town. Do one met their final fate. Winston uh, Zian, how's it? How do we pronounce yeah, it? I think Zian. Yeah, uh, Zian. Uh, Richelieu. Richelieu were overwhelmed by the flopping aquatic horrors in the cove. It was a level one. A short level one. Uh, I think it just wasn't great team composition. I think yeah, I you would have you would have done a lot better if we had preemptively upgraded Winston to have his. The yeah. additional protect because yes. then we could have funneled three people into Winston. Yeah, and then the one's healing target would have been more consistently Winston. Right, and possibly uh, Richelieu. <sighs> okay. Well, let's do some uh, some upkeep here. Got to Those guys are super stressed after their first foray into the wild. They did receive an okay amount of experience, right? Nope. No. No experience. Yeah. Is that all of them? I only see Richelieu on the board. That's so brutal. Montifiquet. But he came back from the Oh yeah, he thing. wasn't there on the mission. Winston. Nothing. Dang. That was a waste other than coming back with some cash. Yeah. I mean you got a good amount of cash. And I got that uh that antique too. Well that was just worth cash. Oh, it just automatically yeah. ports into. It's not a trinket. Okay. Makes sense. Yeah, so you just take the antiquarian to <laughs> oh, just earn, earn more money from that, from any particular mission. Wow. <laughs> uh, well, that was, that was pretty great. Uh, do any of you care about where you go? His zoophobia is worse now, too. Or her, oh. her zoophobia is worse. Right. I think, okay. I have a I have a suggestion. Yeah. Well, first, unequip your trinkets. Okay. And my suggestion is twofold, right? You know, a, a choice. For Richelieu, either you get ahead of the game since you have a bit of cash right now, and put her into the sanitarium. Yeah. And remove that quirk she just obtained. Oh, sure. Instead of healing her sanity. Sure. Then the next week, heal her. Put her in something. That it, makes it sense. It will really delay her yeah. progress as a level zero. Yeah. Even more than it's already been, you know, delayed. But that is like a super detrimental. Well, specifically for her, yeah. Right, that, yeah. It's, yeah. That's all, yeah. It'd be real bad. I mean, you could, you could take a peek at some other ones, but I think... Yeah. Nipping that one in the bud before it becomes overtly expensive. Like, click on Zoophobia. We'll, we'll click it, and then it'll tell you how much. $4,500 to get rid of that. <laughs> oh. You did not. Yeah. Thank God. And then scattering right now should be like, yeah. Not even, ha you know, less than half that. Basically, the antique I brought back is, is paying to get rid of the thing. <laughs> no! <laughs> Net zero. Oh, that's rough. God, I mean, not even zero. We lost a guy. So, by Dwan. Yeah, we spent Dwan. <laughs> we spent a guy for nothing. <laughs> to earn like a uh, like a thousand bucks. <laughs> <laughs> These were hard, uh, hard we learned lessons. We would have net lost if he deleted those I items. Yes. Yeah. Luckily, we found them on his corpse. All right. Yeah, I think that's. 
I think you got to do that. You yeah. got to take. You got to bite Wait, the bullet. What's on that. in that syringe? <laughs> <laughs> My bow arm is incredibly strong. All right. Um, so okay, before we do anything, yeah. figure out where you're putting those labor dudes. What do you want to upgrade? Oh yeah. Or maybe check the stagecoach for new dudes. I guess that might go hand in hand. I can't touch them. No, no, no. You, you just go into the upgrade section of a, an area, and it's free. Because you can you can upgrade any one of these right. places. I, right. So I think you you don't you don't have to like tell them to go somewhere. You just do it. I think you just get to do it for free. There's two jesters. Yeah, yeah, it just deletes the, the cost. Yeah. That's actually really interesting. Okay, wait, maybe... Because, like, the further along it is, the more expensive it is. Yeah, So you definitely. might want to use the freebie on something that you have the most progress in, which could just be the hero barracks. Right. But... I wish it told you what it did used to cost. Yeah, that'd <laughs> nice. be nice. Being tricksy like that. Weird audio glitch there. So what do these what do these areas do? So we got the bar, the brothel, and the gambling, which will just improve Redu reduces the treatment cost. Okay, so it'll make it cheaper to to do those to things. do them. I think after that stage, like once you upgrade it again later, you it, open the second slots. Oh sure, you know, and yeah, things, things like that. Yeah, it's probably every every other. Every, and then the last one is. Yeah. The, uh, the final upgrade to yep. all the slots. Yep. So keep that in mind as well. Not that you have to put tons of people into the bar just yet, but. Oh yeah, I forgot. Check out the rare the rare wagon, the wagon in the middle. Whew. Check out the upgrades on this, because I think a lot of the upgrades in this in the wagon. Or about making these items cheaper and more affordable. That's number of trinkets. Trinket cost. Yeah, because like, they're really expensive right now, and ten percent is meaningful to yeah. hold to hold zero. Yeah. Well. Yeah. But yeah, so it's 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 much bigger now. But I don't remember how much this costs in. Deeds and the such. Right, yeah. Prior to this. Not that you have tons of those to spend right now. Yeah. <laughs> Interesting. But that might be something to look into. Blacksmith and the armor aren't aren't uh, bad choices either, I think. Well, you can't even upgrade your armor at all right now. What's the furnace? Is that cost? Cost. I think you might be able to afford armor smithing just with your probably uh, things. Because uh, oh, <laughs> was the one the one that had the armor bonus, twenty percent less to craft armor. <laughs> we should have given him armor. Oh, Dwan, you will be missed. Oh, we should visit Dwan's grave. Yeah, these are while we're in town. Seeker occultist bled out. Week six. Oh, look at his poor little fucking gravestone. Oh. <laughs> Such a piddly little crappy plank of wood. <sighs> I think your best bet might be the for the freebie to just do it where you've already made progress. Yeah, I agree. I was looking at this. Even though you don't necessarily need that many more spaces. Yeah. You know, eventually you'll want that. What do you... Can you go down to experience recruits? Because you need... Can you hover over the... Instructor mastery level 2? Weaponsmithing and armorsmithing? Jeez. Who's the instructor? Is that in the armor or something? What's the one above this? Oh, it's got to be in the guild. There it yep. is. Instructor Mastery. Wait, do we not have that? I think we have that. We have this one. That particular we... prerequisite. 
allows upgrade to rank two. That's what we needed. Yeah. For one of those three things. The only one we don't have is armor, I think. No, we have, uh... Because we have weapons. Right. Oh, so we could do that. Well, I, I mean... I was just asking about... Yeah. Having nice, nicer dudes show up in the caravan. Right. Yeah, I think you just make your... Roster bigger. bigger. Yeah. yeah. Feels real nice. 20 and 20. That's insane. That's four extra slots. Yeah, we really need deeds. Yeah, deeds are for the, you know, everything kind of cares about something different, mm -hmm. depending. Now, if I don't take these guys... They'll cycle out, I believe. They do cycle out? I think so. I'm actually okay. not sure. Because you can't really dismiss them. Yeah. Uh, from... Well, maybe you can, but... Yeah, I'm not sure. I actually just don't know. You need deeds for this too, yeah. I mean, you can convert de to, you convert some busts into deeds. Yeah. If you want to get that one out of the way. How do I? You got to somehow hover down to that, the double arrow at the very bottom of the screen. Oh, you had it. No, I didn't. Yeah, like a cursor floated above it for a second. Uh, <laughs> I don't know that you did anything, but... There you ah. go. So this is your bus conversion, so you want to go over the number and increase it till you see deeds hit eight. That, was, that would be the cost of that particular conversion. You could do a partial conversion. So you could go change the busts to crests. And then see how many deeds, you know, you could get three of the four, you know, you get half the deeds you need with crests. And half. And the other half with busts. Sure. If you wanted to make that happen right now. If you do that, it'll be the last. It'll, it'll probably be the only upgrade you do. Yeah. This cycle, because yeah, we're just low. Yeah, you'll just be out of resources. I mean, I like the idea of better guys coming along. Yeah, go. For, I say go for it. Whoa. Oop. Uh. Move over to the proper check mark and. Oh yeah, I have to pick one of them. I forget. Yeah. All right, so you did that conversion, then go back and change it back to busts, and then get the other four that you need. And then go back into the blacksmith or wherever it was. Oh, yeah, we're doing that. Now you can do armor smithing. 20. That's got to be a that's got to be a like a really meaningful bump, yeah. In uh, actual abilities. Well, they're only four slots, so it's got to be. You know, it's gonna be funny when it isn't. <laughs> it's like a similar bump again. <laughs> yeah. Well, now you can get an idea of how much it costs to upgrade the uh, stagecoach. Yeah, because it was locked before. Right. Oh, it's still locked. That's, so oh, that's we're only on level, level one. one. You are so far from that. Oh, man. I mean, it's good that you did it. Yeah. Because having any upgrade is better than no upgrade. Oh, no, kitty. It's so bad. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Well, you might want to hire one of those dudes. Oh, yeah. Uh, Maybe not. How do I... There we go. Oh, I wish you had this, the shield already. This guy seems worse. Oh, and he's got all this shit. What's wrong with him? That's not. We'll never drink. Obsessed with killing. So I think that manifests in the game when you do when he is responsible for mm -hmm. killing a, a, a thing. He says stuff that upsets your team because <laughs> he's like really into it. Yeah. Yeah. That's funny. <laughs> Extra stress heal when he goes to the brothel though. This guy's fucked up. <laughs> yeah. And his, yeah, his, you'd have to modify his abilities a little, I think. He doesn't, yeah. he doesn't seem that. No, he's not as good as the other guy. Great. Okay. 
I don't know. I think you might want a new jester, if anything. Based, yeah. Depending on what their skills are. Because right yeah. now you have... What's your current jester have? Ooh. Open up here, guys. Uh, oh, that's not nothing. So he's got those. One of which is upgraded. And he's got the scythe unlocked. Yeah. So he's 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 been invested in a bit. Yeah. Oh, and he's already got the level two weapons. You upgraded his weapons. Yes. Okay. Oh, it looks like you did a full team of upgraded weapons. Yeah. Okay. Cool. See, so, yeah, I don't know. Just compare and contrast these new guys against him. Still don't have that blue one, the, the second from the last one. What does that even do? Buff for the target. Plus two speed of five, actually. Two. Buff self, finale up, and crit up. Yeah. That's that's on all your non-finale things. Yeah. That buff doesn't seem incredible. No. Seems okay. So he's got finale, but he, he can't heal stress. Without spending money on him, it's the right. it's the last one I think. Yeah. Okay, this one seems better. More support roll, less damage. He doesn't have finale, so you're not going to be wasting your time trying to make that happen. Fear of Eldritch. Oh no. <laughs> and zoo zoophobia. He's afraid of a lot of stuff. Yeah. But he likes to attack the unholy. Yeah, this guy's more of a buff, but he has... Oh, that's... I mean, this is kind of an interesting class where you keep him in that third position. And if you ever want him to deal damage, he's not going to deal a lot of it, but he's got a bleed effect that targets two spaces. Yeah. You know, so he's he's definitely utility more than he's any one thing. Support class with some utility. Because you only really care about the top half of all these things. Because you don't have finale on this dude. Right. So. I mean, I mean, it might be better. Heal stress. Than the other one. Buff somebody. Debuff. Right? Or what does it Let's do? Let's see. Self. Oh, it moves himself forward. Moves him forward, marks him. Right. Gives him 20 dodge. Yeah, this is the, this is the setup ability for finale. finale. So what's the, what's the scythe him. there that's locked? Uh, bleed. Three points for three rounds. Yeah, I think that's the ability you want. Either that or the first one. Yeah, like we Actually, the first one moves him, doesn't it? Yeah, this one moves him forward. So yeah, we yeah, want you'd this. invest in that. So it'd be that instead of the finale setup. Yeah. But the other one, then just keep him all as a bleed, bleed and stress heal class. Yeah. Which doesn't seem like the worst. No. I mean, there's, there's some synergies in other classes that deal damage to bled, to bleeding right. dudes better. Yeah. So... I mean, between the two of them, I like this guy better. I do, too. All right, Bolbeck. You're coming with us. Bolbeck. We'll rename him in a moment. Go down. You'll be an extra other one. You will be laughing still at the end. <laughs> All right. Um. So I think the only thing to do after... I'll, I'll wait for you to I'll, I'll set this guy up. Uh, did, think? did you name our, our dead friend? What? Dwund? Dwund. Or was that a default that you kept? I think it was mine. Don't remember. I don't either. Hmm. Hmm. <laughs> Curious. What'll it be? Ziggy. <laughs> sure. You gonna keep that color scheme? Ah, uh, that's what I was... Keep move down. Move down.
Okay. Be the red one. Yes. All right. Uh, we want to unlock abilities. So, on that dude. Where am I going for that? I think it's Guild. the armor. Or yeah, that's what I meant. I'll select him. We want this one. Thousand bucks. It's not cheap. All right. Okay. I think you should pick some people. Yep. That are new. Yep. That you like and yep. that you think will see some action soon. Okay. Maybe. Uh, and give them um, an armor upgrade instead of a damage upgrade. Oh, sure. Because nobody has an armor upgrade because you just obtained the ability to do it. Yeah. And it's 750 bucks per dude. So giving a couple key weaker players a bit yeah. more protection sure. might not go unwarranted. Also, talking of a, you know a recent failure, <laughs> um, mission-wise, it it could it it might be worth noting that it could also have been due to like a hasty attraction to the to the trinkets because sure. it overall made your team slower than not. Yeah, you know and. Not, I don't think it came up too many times where you wish you went first um, any more than you already just want to be going first, you know? Yeah. But just worth worth stating aloud. I want her. Maybe like Sir Freed or Furiosa or Vist might be the best. Yeah. Since he's such a little weenie. <laughs> If he's anything What's like, he? if he's anything say, like let's, Dwan. Let's check him out. What yeah, he's he got, got 19 as well. Is he got the same? No, he doesn't. Uh, those two are the same. He's got those two. Sacrificial, or not sacrificial, uh, weakening curse. And this and one. Reconstruction. He had this. Hands from the abyss. Yeah, the stun effect. This is pulls somebody, clears all the corpse. Okay. What's this, What's this one? Marks the target. Mines are dodge. Okay. Yeah, it's not the worst. No. Definitely having another utility to mark things could be good. Because you what have two characters this? that care about it. Abandon hope. Uh, you reduce your own stress. And everybody else gets stress. No, they have a chance. A chance, but... <laughs> <laughs> so great. <gasps> Dark witch. Does it add three black mana? Well, it costs three time. <laughs> remove what did that say remove mortality buffs mortality debuffs yeah what is that is that like when I don't know you face your mortality and have like a crisis I'm not sure that's curious So much of this game is a mystery to me. Healing while camping, is that what that said? Yeah. Jesus. Great. 100% consumed if stress is above 50. Oh, he doesn't eat? If he's stressed? That's pretty good. What's it called? Stress faster. Ah. Okay. Anyways, uh, what are we doing? Armor. Yeah, I was just considering that he has low health, basically. And right now you're on Sir Gerard. Right. So this gives you a dodge base buff and a health base buff. So that's what armor does. Right. That's pretty good. Definitely should have been on... One. <laughs> yeah. Poor boy. Okay. Well, I like her a lot. Yeah, she dodges like crazy. Yeah, so. With the build she had, so. Couldn't hurt. Yes. Oh, you can't until he becomes level one. Ah. So it wouldn't have mattered for Dwan. Sorry, Dwan. You're dead, anyways. Yep. 
So I can't All do right. this to any of them. So you could do it to like, I don't know, Sir Freed or Popopo. Popopo! <laughs> oh man. <laughs> what does he even do? Oh god. Look at his quirks. Clumsy and he's afraid of beasts. He's got a zero dodge. <laughs> he just faces. He just takes damage to the face. <laughs> he's got a lot of positive quirks, though. Yeah, he does. Hates those Eldritch. Range skills. More accurate with his range uh, uh, effects. And, and melee. He does more damage with, with his melee. melee, yeah. All right. But he's he's part of your mark squad. Right. He deals more damage to marked things, has a marked oh, effect. Oh, right. Okay. Marked. Two mark them. effects. Yeah. And then what does this do? And that does more damage against stunned enemies. Okay. Yeah, he's a good support damage dealing class. Yeah. Bounty hunter. Yeah, I mean, giving him armor doesn't seem like the worst. How much health does he have right now? I didn't even look at that stat. Um, 25? Yeah. And it becomes 30? Yeah. This dodge is doubled. There's five points. Yeah. Yeah, see, I mean, if you want to upgrade the guy, I good. don't know what I want to upgrade. Joey? You can choose not to upgrade anything. You know, that's still also an option because it's 750 bucks or there's no oh. do it. God, I didn't mean to do that. Um, who's our other guy that marks stuff? Least? So the arbalist marks. Yeah, but she's not coming she's with us not for a while. She's not coming with us for a while. Uh, Cuthbert, I, no, no, not Cuthbert. Who's the other one that marks? There's another. He does more damage against a mark. Oh, so he can't. He could benefit from. Oh, he's got repost too. Mm -hmm. That's okay. Yeah, he was waiting for him to come back out of that. Yeah, that bar. He's he's, he's real good. Um, there's another, Winston. Winston, your man at arms has. Uh, marked stuff there. Yeah, while they're marked, and then he marks himself. Right, but the the other one it, it adds bonuses to everybody. Yeah. If the person they're hitting is marked. Well, this hits every opponent, so as long right. as someone's marked on their team, yeah. this will help them. Right. Okay. So he has, he's got a piece in that puzzle. So could, How many mean, of those we people could, we could have, we Winston, Winston, Cuthbert, and... Popo po, po so far all care oh, about Ariadne marked. might have marked stuff, the grave digger. Bleed resist down. Does more damage against marked. Yeah. <laughs> Nobody marks anyone. <laughs> yeah, you po, po, po marks and so does uh your okay. arbalist, but your arbalist, like you say, is gone. For the, okay, this for the marks next a couple target of weeks. too. This guy he has a couple that mark them. Yeah. Okay. Does Furiosa have a mark? Oh, yeah, she might. She does so much damage. Doesn't look like it. She uh -huh. bleeds. Which is sweet, though, because a She's couple of these good. guys have uh, the... Takes bleed resist down and stuff. Yeah, you can do a so. bleed You can do a bleed build. Oh, man. I want to do so many things. <laughs> <laughs> Well, do you, do you have any intention of upgrading anybody else? Um, what? Before we get into, you know, team composition for your next foray. Let's, I want to give Cuth, well, he's, I know he's not low level. Um, I guess we hate, we, we can only upgrade armor on level one or higher. Correct. So let's, I mean. You could still do Cuthbert. Yeah. Cuthbert will become the most invested in. Because he's got a weapon upgrade already. Yeah. All right. 15 dodge as his base. He's a fucking beast. Yeah. God, the Cuthbert Winston squad. You got to get Winston upgraded or leveled up, man. As soon as you're able. You should put Winston and yeah. Zane or Z Zion away and yeah, get get them doing some sort of All right. weight loss treatment or something. Uh, stress loss treatment. 
He doesn't have any preferences. Okay. Um, so let's... Well, check the people who might have preferences first, just in case you block options. Well, she's away. Tipler? Oh, yeah, she only drinks or something, I think. Will only drink. Okay, so she has to go to the tavern. Okay. Who's your other person? Winston, uh... Oh, they died. Yeah, he died. Yeah, he's Sorry. dead. One. Yeah. <laughs> okay, so we'll go to the tavern. We'll send... Or one. Luckily, the mayor is not drinking. We'll send her here. Some thousand dollars. Thousand dollar drinking habit. Get your shit together, Zion. Winston, are you a gambling man? Jeez. The thrill of winning. Oh, no, he wants to go to the brothel. Does he? Yes. Are you, I don't think that's Winston you're thinking of. Oh, no, you're it's right. It's a different person. Oh, it's the other one. We were like, this guy's messed up. Ah, right. It the was a man, man at arms, arms but yeah. it was he, we didn't take him. Right out. Okay. So we can go to the gambling hall. We could go to the abbey. I don't know that. I don't know if it does, and it might, if the monetary value of where you're sending them matters in terms of how much benefit they'll gain from it when they come back. You know what I mean? Yeah. Because you can, like I say, put them in the penance hall, which is more expensive than the cloistering them or yeah. having them go to the brothel or whatever. Right. But I don't know if that matters. I'm not sure. I don't know. If you send them to the penance hall, you're spending basically half your money. Yeah, I know. So... Consider that. It may be that, like, whatever squad you put Winston on, you know, two weeks from now... Heals some stress, Heals too. some stress, so you, you may not need whatever bonus it, you know, yeah. it'll give you. So you might just want to cloister him. All right. That seems like all the people taken care of. Whew. It's nighttime. All right, that's, uh... That was week seven? Six? What was that? Six. No, well... L1, I think. Oh, that just tells you what the current event is. There it is. That was week six. Yep. Or no, no, we, we, were, we just did week seven. No, 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 no that yeah, was week that six. Yeah, week yeah, six. we just did week yep. six. About to do week seven. <laughs> And uh, we had our first, first death. death. Oh boy. One and a half months into it. Well, it was a shorter. Are we, you want to call it? Yeah, for like this for, episode. For an episode, yeah. Yeah, uh, yeah it was a. <laughs> it wasn't a full short quest. <laughs> it was a short, short quest. Yep. And it ended prematurely. Um, I don't think Josh learned any lessons. Um, yeah, I'm sure it did. Like what? Team composition's important. All right. Probably wasn't the best team. Yeah, but you also didn't uh, know what you were I, up against in the in the Absolutely. No, in the cove, that's so. the lesson we learned, right? The what, cove, what's the cove? What's the in cove, the cove has in Smouthian fish people that are really hit hard. like a truck. Yeah, especially the jellyfish. The jellyfish killing didn't those. Hit. The jellyfish did not hit no, like a truck. But that but bleed, man. <laughs> and I told you to prepare for the bleed. Yeah, I brought some bandages. Enough. I didn't bring enough. <laughs> <laughs> you only brought enough. If Dwund bled people, <laughs> not if you would receive blood yes. bleed naturally. Yeah. What about the prep? Did you do you feel like you undervalued the equipment you bring? Maybe uh, only a little, but not. You seem it seemed like like you overspent on torches a little bit. Probably, yeah. Um, if you if you didn't like get savage like you did, you probably overspent on food a little bit. Yes. That one was. More reasonable though, I think, once that. Yeah. But yeah, it's <laughs> it's impossible to know what you'll be up against, and yep, preparing for everything is a fool's gambit. <laughs> That's why this game's great. All right, uh, thanks for watching whatever episode this was, whatever number it says at the top or wherever it says numbers. It doesn't say it here, right here in the audio. <laughs> <laughs> we appreciate it. Um, what's our outro? Don't stare too long. Yep, something like that.
Or do. I think that's what it is. Yeah. <laughs> or do. Yeah. <laughs> Don't stare too long into the darkness. Or we're, do. We're going to. <laughs> but yeah, we'll see you guys next episode. We're going to do another week. Yeah. Week seven. Coming up. We're one 2.0 will die. <laughs> oh. By jellyfish again. Yes. All right, bye, guys. <laughs> Toodaloo.